saving and downloading your Blackboard course materials against future need. To archive your course completely, you'll want to go to your course control panel, to packages and utilities, and export archive course. An export package will contain just course content. If you wish to have both your course content and all student enrollment information, grades, submissions, and so on included, you'll want to archive your course. Just click the Archive Course button. There's generally no need to include grade history, center history. Leave the links under file attachments as you see them here. And click Submit. The course archive will be created and a link to it will appear here shortly. Once that archive appears, mouse over the file name, click on the action link next to the course and select Open. This will open a file save dialog on your computer. You may want to make a folder in which to store these archives. And then just hit Save. This archive can be restored to Blackboard later and will contain all of your information, course content, student information, and submissions. If you wish to just have a copy of your gradebook uh, separate from this archive, which can be viewed without access to Blackboard, you can go to your Grade Center to Full Grade Center, click Work Offline, and then Download. Take the Full Grade Center, set the delimiter type to comma, and download location to my computer, and then submit. Once the data is saved to a file, click the download link, and save the file in a CSV format, comma, delimited format. Again, in order to view the full archive, the file will have to be restored to a Blackboard system. We will be able to do that for you for two years after ceasing to use Blackboard at the Community College District. You'll just need to contact Online Learning Pathways in order to do that. If you wish to view your gradebook at any time, you can simply double-click the downloaded file, which should open in Excel or another uh, spreadsheet program or viewer on your computer.